Welcome back to What Did I Just Watch, the show that features the wildest videos on the internet. Today we're taking a look at a 102 year old's very unusual hobby and a kitten who has an unbelievable best friend. But first, let's check out this fisherman's life and death struggle involving a catch that weighs more than a baby hippo. If hitting the gym and working out seems like way too much effort, then spare a thought for this mad lad fisherman. He battles it out with a feisty fish for over an hour and even gets pulled into the water, dragged along the lake bed, and still holds on to his rod. You came on image. Jimmy. Shouldn't 这个这个这个一会儿要要拿往兜一下吧不用快翻壳儿兄弟别别伤了他别别用力就轻轻拖他就可以来来来来抬起手机来来辛苦啊哎这局也累了that fish is an absolute beast weighing in at a mind-blowing 165 pounds. The craziest part of this video is that when he finally catches the thing, he lets it go. What are you doing? What's the point of fishing if you're not going to eat the fish or at least keep it as a pet? <laughs> You might think when you make it to 100, you'd start to take things easy. After all, you've been witness to a century of history. What you don't normally do is pack your bags, head out to a ranch, and casually throw yourself on top of a horse. That's right, when spying on your neighbors and drinking coffee gets too mainstream, you've got to spice it up with a life-affirming horse ride. Moving forward, and we'll see once you get up here, and if you feel comfortable, I'll, I'll put you on up. Well, let me get both of you. No problem. Let me see. Look at, that. Look at her. And I, now if you're all right, I'm going to get well, here. I was going to lift you. Let's see. Put this leg over. Wait Can you do it? I've got you. I've got you. <laughs> you did it. Look at you, you Mom. Yeah, you don't know how, how stiff that leg is. Here, let me put you. There you are. Mm. One minute, and I'll put your skirt back up. We don't have to get a picture of this, because it may never happen. <laughs> Yes, it will. I'll we look are. forward to seeing you next year. Well, look I'll at look you. You got up there. You are going to lift me. Oh, I'm going right <laughs> No, he's going to let give you a mallet really? and let you go on the yeah. holo run. You you lead and I'll, and I'll stand here. Yep. Look, Come you've on. got him all trained. Here. Go get a lead up. He knows I'm not supposed to be on here. No, he is being... Are you nervous, Mom? Well, I've got you. I'm no sense to being nervous. Here. I mean, <laughs> I, mean, I just enjoy it. Pocket. We'll get him. You're here. Well, <laughs> this is not the time to be nervous. <laughs> Keep him going, baby. There we go. See, you said you wanted to ride again. I did. Should I? Should I have said that? Well, yes. <laughs> get up, buddy. It looks so easy. That grandma doesn't look a second over 60, and she's wrangling that horse like it's her day job. First, I hope I make it to be her age, and if I do, I want to be just as wild and unpredictable as she is. 
Everybody knows cat people, the types with cat memorabilia filling their living rooms, along with the faint scent of cat pee, but have you ever seen a coyote person? Well, buckle up, because we found someone who decided to put a coyote and a cat in the same room together. And they're best friends. Have you ever seen a coyote and a cat playing together? Because guess what, I haven't, and honestly, I'm not sure how I feel about it. I'm shook, and praying that one day the coyote doesn't decide it deserves a feline snack. That wraps things up for this week. Drop a comment below to let me know which video was your favorite, and don't forget to leave a like, hit subscribe, and click the bell to stay up to date with all the latest from Daily Mail.